Alright, here's the lamp I found. Got this at a thrift store for 14 bucks. Well, it was half off, so seven dollars. It didn't have a base or nothing like that. It was white. Uh so here. Oh, I like these lamps because you can literally move them everywhere. It's over the couch right now, like in the stays. I added these right here so you can easily uh, move it. Looks pretty good. Down here for the base. It's a pine cone that was in the box up in the attic for the longest time with a grandfather clock. Mom was... I always thought it was grandfather's clock, and it was a grandfather's clock. But Mom threw away all the stuff to it, so I kept the pine cone a long, long time ago. Using that as a counterweight, I used uh, coat hangers to wrap around here really tightly to, and bolted it on both sides so it's looped then bolted so it stays in there really tight, doesn't move both sides. This was the top of a cane handle that I had sitting around for years that I don't, I don't know why I saved it. I was like, maybe I'd use it for something. Well, I finally found a use for it. Had to cut it in half to get it inside of this blue handle here, which is really, really hard plastic. And then I used, I was going to use leather to cover the rest of it, but the leather didn't want to strap down, so... I uh, used rubber with a fake synthetic leather color to it. But that's one handle to pick it up here. Then there's another handle up here that I actually used as a base for this thing. And that is a piece of wood I found in the backyard. It wasn't even shaped. I just knew it was big enough to use for this and I was in a hurry. It looked rotted, but I cleaned it up and it came out nice. Uh, shaped it, colored it. I got two bolts and then there's a post up here that this just sits on top of. Uh, this right here was off of our 65 inch 4K TV my son broke. Uh, I recycled the legs off of that, or kind of kind of to a TV like that. So we had it wall mounted this time. It's not bad. I had a little extra weight back here. I don't know what to do with that yet. I'm just going to color it. But yeah, it's a very steady lamp, works good, and I added an LED bulb to it, so that, uh, let's see here we got, remote control. So you got regular, regular stuff and tons of colors. So I have to put a fastener on there to hold it steady. It's on an uneven table right now. These came out of a, like a little mini wooden desk thingy. But one with a lot of blue. It's got fake light, real light. Came out nice. I'm happy with it. Still got a couple things to do, like put some uh, legs that fold out from underneath here to give it a little extra width when it's tilted all the way over here. Because it holds, but I want it to be a little more sturdy. So, fold out legs eventually that I can tuck in and pull out when I want. That's one thing that needs to be done, and a fastener for that needs to be done as well. I think it's done pretty, came out pretty nice. Yeah. Not bad for a $7 antique lamp from, I think it was like 1978.